All right, here we go. This is going to be the first Hello World test with the Shape Ogo 3. Um, I just downloaded the file, got everything all zeroed out. So here we go. I'm going to click Run. Hopefully, all goes well. Got the permanent marker that they included. And I think, oh, wait. I already loaded. And play. I think I'm doing this right. Insert tool one. Ooh. Got a piece of uh, paper underneath, and it seems like it's a little bit thicker. You hear the marker rubbing a little bit more. Pretty neat. Pretty cool. So let's load up the second part according to the email that I got. Um, once you have that done, it's going to be this uh, box art hatch. So we got that in there. And then it says right after we have it, run the same pr or that project right after the shape of is made. So insert the tool. Oh, good. He didn't draw on the, the board, the waste board. <laughs> Ah, so what it's doing now is just patching it in. Very cool. It actually draws just like a 3D printer. I guess it's using the same motors and all that stuff. <laughs> Pretty neat. It is drawn a little bit outside of the lines, but I'm, just, I'm guessing it's because my tape and my permanent marker, it's moving a little bit and with the inconsistency of the board, because I have a piece of, uh, uh, like another thick, thicker uh, paper underneath or newspaper advertisement to prevent the marker from bleeding through the paper. And also, my table is moving a lot too. But this is a first test, temporary test in my uh, dining room. 
Not bad. It only took about five minutes to, uh, you know, write this down and patch up the, the lettering. That is awesome. And I even installed the homing switches on here, as you can see, right underneath the router. I got the homing switch. That's what you guys see here. Ah, very excited. Ha ha. Now I can go to sleep. Hello world. It's alive. Awesome. Thanks for watching, guys.